This project is sponsored by PCBWay. This year, PCBWay organized the seventh project design contest, where in addition to electronic and mechanical project, also has been added a new code category STM32 project. For the best selected projects are provided rich prizes in cash, coupons and special gifts. Submit your project for particip participation in this contest from 2nd September 2024 to 9th January 2025. For more detailed information and instruction, visit the given page. Let's PCB way always be your first choice. Hello, the HP DL1414 is a 16-segment LED display with four printable fields that is over 20 years old. It has a red gallium arsenide phosphor screen to which we can add the Epitaph Smart because it is capable of printing alphanumeric characters on its fields. Uh, the screen is controlled by a CMOS integrated sync circuit embedded in a plastic housing. Uh, this circuit contains RAM, ASCII decoder, multiplexer and LED drivers. Thanks to these features, no additional components are needed to connect this display to the microcontroller. More displays can be connected in series, uh, where for each subsequent one it is necessary to assign uh, another GPIO to the WR pin similar to the SPI interface. In one of my previous videos I present you a miniature clock with these displays as well as the way in which static and moving test can be written on, this, on it. Unfortunately at that moment I didn't manage to create a version of the code in which I could adjust the time manually with buttons which would make this nice retro clock completed. Although that when making the case I incorporating three buttons for this purpose. Now I will present you this new version of the project where in addition to manually setting the time I also added an alarm function with a pulsating beep on a small buzzer. The device is very simple to make and consists of several components. Arduino Nano microcontroller board, two pieces HP DL1414 LED displays, DS3231 real time clock module, three buttons, and small active buzzer. Now follows a brief description of the device functions. Immediately after switching on, a moving demo test appears on the display, after which the set time is displayed in the form of hours, minutes and seconds. To enter the menu for setting the correct time, press the S button. Now with the H button, uh, the hour is set and with the M button, the minutes are set. With the next click on the S button, we enter the menu for settings alarm. The settings principle is the same as before, only this time uh, the letter A appears at the beginning, unlike the previous menu. Now we press S button again and time and alarm are set. The alarm is activated at the set time in the form of short beeps with a duration of 500 milliseconds and is deactivated simply by pressing the set button.
we will deactivate alarm on the S button. And finally a short conclusion, this is a small simple but really interesting unusual clock that shows the time on retro displays made by Hewlett Packard at the turn of the last century and was also used for calculators and measuring instruments.